for all those components which we explicitly made non-linear there is no need of defining crack stiffness modifiers because now the effect of cracking and yielding is explicitly modeled right but in a particular non-linear computer model there can be many elements uh, many components within one element which will be modeled which will still be modeled using linear element right let me give you an example uh, quickly for a beam element we know that we have two plastic hinges at both ends but in between them is still a linear component for that component we have to define uh, the the crack stiffness modifiers similarly there can be many beams in our model which we will not define plastic hinges like secondary beams like um, uh, uh, some non critical elements or some elements which we want to model or design as elastic elements right uh, some uh, columns which we may want to model or design as uh, elastic elements right so for all those elastic components we should uh, we should explicitly define those uh, crack stiffness modifiers but for any elastic components let's say i make a beam and i use the fiber modeling approach for the whole length of that beam right i make a column and i define the fiber modeling approach for whole length of that column now the nonlinear effect is spread along the whole length so no need to define crack stiffness modifiers because the effect which crack stiffness modifier of account that is explicitly accounted now using a nonlinear stress strain curve so the program knows that at what fc uh, at what fc value or sigma value the concrete is going to crack right so uh, it will automatically reduce the stiffness or soften that particular element uh, when the cracking point is exceeded so that uh, reduction is automatically accounted uh, so no need to define the factor from building code right uh, but uh, you will see that in a non linear model also for ex example slabs you may not want your slabs to model as non linear so all the crack stiffness modifier for slabs should be applied for slabs right and for other elements which you do not want to model uh, as inelastic right